Good morning, everybody. Andy McCall from the Kansas City Star here at Target Field, where the Royals won 5-1 to one to extend their winning streak to four games, uh, all coinciding with, guess who, Alcides Escobar in the leadoff spot. It's a bizarre sort of phenomenon that no one can explain, and it's probably all uh, causation and not correlation or whatever that um, sort of sabermetric phrase is. Anyway, um, the really interesting stuff going on today, uh, Urano Ventura was excellent. Uh, he threw seven innings of one run ball, he struck out 11, matched a career high, he looked dominant, you know, he didn't give up a hit until the fifth inning, and um, most likely he's going to start game one of the American League Division Series, it's going to be tough for Johnny Cueto, um, who's pitching tomorrow to come back on short rest, he's never done that in his career, um, Nedios has not revealed his rotation yet, but it looks like it will be Ventura. Um, also in game one, the Royals hope will be Lorenzo Cain, who came back after two days off due to a bone bruise in his, uh, his knee. Um, Cain looked great at the plate. He had two doubles. He actually hit a go-ahead infield single, and he walked. Um, but he was not running particularly well, and so there's obviously some concern, some concern there. Um, Cain said you know, he's going to have to nurse basically this bone bruise for the next three to four weeks. There's not really much you can do about it. It's not a uh, structural issue. It's just a pain management issue, and so that's what he's going to be working on. Um, Cain has been the Royals' best player all season long. He's going to be a top five guy, maybe a top three guy on MVP ballots. So um, they need him at his best you know, come uh, next week. So anyway, that's all for us here at, uh, at Target Field. Um, we'll see tomorrow if the Royals can, uh, can somehow leapfrog the Blue Jays for home field advantage. And until then, you can read all about the goings-on with the Royals in the page of the Kansas City Star, kansascity.com, and on our True Blue app. Have a good night.